Hello, I am Dr. Sanjeev Gulati, Chairman of Nephrology and Kidney Transplant at Fortis Hospitals NCR and the immediate past president of the Indian Society of Nephrology. Today we will discuss an important update. A major cold medicine that is showing beneficial effects on the kidneys and this study just recently came in the Journal of Diabetology and some newspapers also covered it. So first of all, I would like to tell you that diabetes is the number one cause of chronic kidney disease in our country today. And first of all, we had noticed this trend in 19 or 99 and we had published our study in a journal called Renewal Failure Nomic. You know that India has become the diabetes capital of the world and that is why diabetes is also the number one cause of chronic kidney disease. In the last few years, a lot of drugs have become available which are working in diabetes and kidney diseases. Come to number one, a centimeter angiotensin receptor blockers. This was about 20 years old medicine and it also controls blood pressure protein also controls and increases the life of the kidneys. There were no new drugs for years after that. Number two, which we have covered you earlier also is CLT2 inhibitor in which a drug called Debgloxin came out and it was shown that it also protects the heart, also protects the kidneys, also controls sugar. Number three, the studies I saw are in my name and we also covered this in a preview video. This was a new drug that reduces inflammation and reduces protein leakage and thus protects the kidneys. Number four is a drug called GLP-1 receptor analogs which is available in oral tablet, also available in injectable form so a lot of drugs came. But the most important thing is that whatever medicine came, the study trial took place. This occurred in at least four to 6,000 patients. This means that these studies were good in thousands of patients. Despite this, kidney disease is progressing. So we need more medicines even today so that we can extend the life of the kidney more than in this regard, a new drug, i.e. M new study came. The name of the drug along with the older drug is liver cetosine, which is a very common drug. We use a lot of coal. And first of all, a few years ago, it was studied in a rat model. No one has ever seen you. Allopathic medicine comes, its details are investigated. It's not like we call you and say, let's take this medicine. I think it will be fine. No, first comes the experimental data that is seen in experimental animals. And they made a model of diabetes by giving a drug in rats. That is, they made the rat diabetic and gave it this nigocetrosine. Seeing that there was protection in it, then after that a kidney doctor in Egypt did a study in 60 people. 30 people were given levocetrazine, 30 people were not given and the rest of the 30 people have been given the rest of the drugs that I have just told you and it was seen that levocetrazine was protecting the kidneys, reducing protein leakage. How was it reducing that ketrazine is a chemical called histamine. What increases in general allergies, we give antihistamine drugs to reduce it. But you will be surprised to know that the kidneys also have histamine receptors. So when this histamine is more than it acts on the kidney and releases many chemicals from there, which increases kidney disease, increases protein leakage. So these researchers have seen that the drug called liver citizen, which costs about 40, 50 pays, its biggest plus point is that it means chip and is available in Italy available in every corner. When they gave me this medicine, which is protein leakage, kidney function decreased, stabilized. Well, what are these drawbacks of this study? The biggest drawback that a study has come up so far is, we do not know as we have told that there are multiple studies available in it as many older drugs. In thousands of patients, it has the experience of only 30 patients. 
So is that why you should go and eat liver sooty sin? No, we will update you time to time as the studies come out. But my advice to you is that you should definitely discuss the study with your doctor. And if your doctor feels like it, he can give you 5 mg of glivocetirazine and monitor it carefully. But it can also have side effects. It makes you unconscious more if the kidney function is more weak and its safety data is also coming. But this is a very interesting development and it will give us an added value of kidney protection. And as soon as more studies come on this page, you must subscribe to our channel. Watch in which we tell you the latest scientifically valid treatment and scientific advances. Then in brief, this cough and cold medicine, Livoketrajine, this has been seen in a study. It is protecting the kidneys and now we are weighing some additional studies in which it is validated so that we can use it in common use in kidney patients. Thank you. Generate by AI.